Hi, this is a review for Things on the iPad. There's an iPhone version and a Mac version as well, but the Mac version costs 50 bucks, and but there is a free trial. It's 15 days, and they sync with each other over the same network automatically every time you open the app if you buy it. So Things is a great to-do list app. You can add to-dos. You can add tags. You can add notes. And you can add a due date. You can you can add different folders. So say I want to do that today, you just add to the to-do. The inbox is generally the place where all your new to-dos aggregate, but you can do say today, it'll also make a badge on the icon. So let's go to today. This, these are all the to-dos I need to do today. I can look I can sort by tag. So this is my tag. I can I can sort by things I want to do today by starring them. And then I can check it off once I've finished it. Every time you finish something, it'll go into the logbook. So these are all my log to do's. You can create projects. So these are the projects I have. There's settings of the app. You can manage the tags and manage folders. And then there's general settings for badges and whenever it logs. You can have this sync with the Mac version and the iPhone version. It's probably my it's the one I use. It's probably my favorite to-do list app. You can do all kinds of great things with it. The Mac one's a little more in depth with drag and drop. The iPhone version is just like this one. So definitely check it out. It's